Well, good morning. We're back with the demo a lot. And as you can see, since last time, I have made a couple of changes to the island I chose as my sailing island. Added a little, I don't know, a hut, I guess you would call it. Put a fire in here, cook stove, some storage. That way, when I'm out traveling, I have a place to put materials that I find. I also created a little helm, an official helm, and I did start figuring out a little bit about the sailing. So, one of the things I was trying to figure out that I was having trouble with was the raising and lowering of the island. And it was right in front of my face the whole time. So, derp. Let's go ahead and head towards the starter island. I want to see if I can't pick up some more materials from there. And we are going at a fair clip. I left everything open so you could, like, <laughs> I don't know, see where I was going. So, to raise and lower the island, you use space and control. So, space raises the island. Control lowers it. And like I said, it was right in front of my face. So, that was kind of goofy of me not to notice. Stop here, and we should be able to jump down just fine from here. Let's see if I can remember my way around here, huh? Well, I certainly can. Here's my old storage. stone left in there. Nothing else. Old tools. My old fire. Bed. Can I leave in here? Nope. Pick up some more water while I'm here. Now I want it to grab, one of the things I want to grab is some leaves because I've used up so many. And I know here it's easy to get more of those. Jump down. Always brand new saplings growing. Up here. Excuse me. Yo, thank you for your leaves. We'll not spend too much time here. So, you know, I don't remember again. I thought it was around here I started seeing the tomatoes. many do I have 
almost a full stack already. Yay. Yeah, there's our island up there. Whoop. Messed up. Okay. <laughs> that was not what I wanted to do. There we go. Closer. There's the waterfall. Look at that storm. Wow. Island. There. I guess I'm never going to remember where this is. It's always going to find it by accident. I think it was over there. You know what? Why not look, though? Grab you. I can. No, I guess I'm not going to find them. I know there are tomatoes here, though. Someday I'll run across them again. for the island. Go ahead and pop that in. Sort it. Ooh, we got enough basic materials, I think. Okay, the sail's a little bit in the way. It's not perfect. It almost seems like the glider is faster. I guess in a way, I do understand why they want to nerf it. Still don't I wish they wouldn't, though. It's 
especially not for early on. Well, definitely does make a nice little boat. Gotta be some storm in order for it to be throwing giant boulders around. The game definitely does have the feeling of crap now. Okay. I'm going to park right over here. It's one of the things I did notice in my video and was also pointed out to me. And thank you to the person that did point it out to me was that there was more stuff in the cave in this island that I missed. Right off the bat, I noticed one thing I missed was... Uh, The coal. There was coal in that cave. Oop. Almost. Almost fell. Now. Might have already come back for the coal. Oh. Almost missed that again. Ah, there was something else in here. Oh, wow. Oh, I need that. I need that so bad. Whoa, I missed all sorts of stuff. Okay. And that sounds like a big old storm. Of course, we got that already. Yeah, it's a big old storm. It's my island. Over there. We'll stay in the cave for now. I don't want to risk dumping around in that storm. At least here I'm relatively warm and dry. Dig everything, right? Well, while we're waiting, 
what did we get? We got some grain. Ah, grain for the pheasant. We got some more mixer fiber, which we need for rope. Some leaves. We got lots of coal. We got some cloth and some hay. That was definitely worth coming back here. The cave sounds creepy when it's stormy. Make sure I'm not missing any more coal. Hello, I got two stacks of it. That's pretty good. At least I think it's pretty good. I love how it just like stops. This one. But it's still storing. The creepy noises just stop, like you end up in dead silence. Okay, there's my island, so, well, whoa, that was a big step. Oh boy. That was a big step. <laughs> One of the reasons I put on this little hut is when it starts raining you can't see like five inches in front of your face so I put this in so I could have some place to go and get dry all right while I was waiting for storms to pass worth coming back for. Right. Home is that way. That's the island with the pheasant on it. That's another corrupted island. another island somewhere. Whoa, it's way down there.
look safe. Of course, it is right next to what appears to be another corrupted island. That's a big boulder. Let's avoid getting hit by it, shall we? Okay, how close are we? Close enough. We should lower the island a little more, shouldn't I? Whoa! Oh wow, that was um, very close. days I'll learn. Whoa, I almost ran into that. I don't think that would feel too good. All sorts of bushes here. Oh, tomatoes. Grab all of those. More tomatoes. I'll be able to make some more, was it, uh, mixed vegetables? I think it was. Been eaten. And just in case, that's not probably too. Come on, you can get up there. Come on, girl, you can get up there. Really? Really? There we go. Wow. Lots and lots and lots of tomatoes. Oh, I saw some more. Maybe not. Another nice island. I like mine better, but this one's not bad. I'm just doing a little alcove here. More tomatoes. I think 
we want to get anywhere else, we're going to have to take to the air. Not like that. <laughs> I said take to the air to fall to my death. Oh, we got, have we looked at this one already? Apparently I've been here before. Let's not have explored very far. Oh, I remember because I found pumpkins here. Lots and lots of pumpkins. How are we doing for a space? Very good. Same one. Oh, water. We'll grab that. One stack should be enough. Oh yes, I remember because I came into this cave. Hey, I do believe I did this all off screen. This cave is very dark. It goes to different spots. I think there's might be more than one opening. That. Okay, so now that one didn't go anywhere. And that one goes out to the water. Okay. It's a big island. Well, we got, oh, found some blueberries. This island has the tomatoes, pumpkins, and blueberries so far. That little tiny pond here. That's cute. I wish the island I picked had a little tiny pond like that. It would be perfect. More tomatoes. Wow, more everything. Oh, more pumpkins. Must have gone around the circumference of the island again. There's our sail, <laughs> sail island. I gotta come up with a better name for it than that. Okay, already gotten that one too. This is a huge island. 
definitely not sail worthy. And it's raining again, because of course it. Think we're gonna find anything else here right now? Or maybe? Whoa! <gasps> oh! Oh, what's this? Well, I don't know, but let's get out of the rain. Oh, wow. That was not something I was expecting to find. Ooh, almost fell. Oh, let's find out if uh, this works to keep us out of the rain. It does. Probably me not the biggest of storms, but definitely out of the rain in general. I don't have any soil on me. A wooden, wooden bucket. Okay. That's the sea. wooden bucket in here. I don't have any soil. Oh, wow. I'm actually excited about that. Okay, let's get back inside. Wait out the rain. So while I was waiting for the storm to pass, I tested out a few more recipes, and I ended up getting... A healthy smoothie, which is a basic meal made from veggies, fruits, and liquid, and a savory smoothie, basic meal made from fruits and liquid. So the savory smoothie gives us 18 hit points for eight minutes, but it's a healthy smoothie. I made another fresh bowl, made another mixed veggie, fruit salad, and we're going to go ahead and eat another mixed veggie. And of course it's starting to get dark. I really don't want to be wandering around this island at night trying to find these, uh, they look like grow I wonder if I can take them with me. I don't know. I guess we're going to find out. Okay, so it's daylight again, and we have come across these. I'm wondering if I break them. Good. Do I want to? Because can't grow I can't make these myself I definitely could use them wondering if I can mark the island on the map <laughs> there's no map oh and there are things to harvest Wow, this place is a lot more than I expected it to be. Is that that waterfall? I think it is. Okay, so now I can remember, kind of remember where this is at. It's right above the waterfall. Probably not the island I should just be randomly jumping around in. All right, so mark this island as something to come back to. Ooh. <laughs> that was probably not the smartest move. Go 
ahead and put that away. That in there. Eat some food. You never know. We'll do some fruit salad. That's pretty basic. Okay. I can't complain. My bags are full of goodies. Like a couple of corrupted islands there. Go ahead and raise the boat. Okay, that's enough. Thank you. Wow. Just wow. I'm like really impressed with this game. Is, is it perfect? No, by no means is it perfect. They do have a lot that they need to do before it goes live. It's by no means done either. I don't think any game's ever been perfect. But it's shaping up to be a really, really good game. I'm honestly looking forward to seeing where they take this. I don't know. What do you think? Are you interested in this game? Are you going to play it when it comes out? What do you think that they could add or improve on? Let everybody know in the comments below. For, as for me, I am absolutely playing this game when it comes out. Especially if it continues on in the direction it's going. Absolutely. Until next time. Bye for now.